Hello anyone, welcome back to the bench. Today we got a special treat from Oceanus Brass, the Enigma Coffer, a neat little puzzle box. Um, I just want to do a quick demo just to kind of show how it works um, with the dovetail cuttings in there. Um, it's a slide top, however, uh, it's got an internal ball that rests um, either in between the two in locked position or it'll uh, rest actually within the up, uh, top bottom I don't know either one so right now you can see it's locked um, what you can do is just give her a tap and she's open and you can see the beautiful dovetail cuts on there goodness um, and so there's the the locking ball um, and then on this side it's got the recess so in the unlocked position which it's in now the ball is flush and the top just slides oops hey doodle can I get it ah oh, goodness I gotta line it up right and there are magnets in the corners that just kind of hold it in place and then to lock give her a tap back Ooh, gotta lock it in the right direction so again it's locked unlocked or not okay again <laughs> direction is most important um, now something else that I noted uh, in the comments of where I bought it uh, they give you an extra never mind that fuzz give you an extra locking ball um, and I guess what some people have been doing is just kind of sticking it in the lid and then not being able to get it out but what they recommend you can do is take one of the magnets try to get it to stick to the magnet and then just kind of slide it off So that's that little trick, I guess. Um, and something else that I kind of pondered was uh, you can see only one side of the lid. Let's call this the lid. Only one side has the recess for the locking bowl. So when it's on there, that would be to lock it. What I thought you could do is if you didn't want it to lock or I don't know, for whatever reason you didn't want it to lock, you could actually slide it in that way and it can't lock there's no place for the ball to drop into so there you go just a neat little toy that i've been playing with lately but uh hey thanks for hanging